The United States has put Johnson & Johnson in charge of a plant that ruined 15 million doses of its COVID-19 vaccine and has stopped British drug maker AstraZeneca PLC from using the facility. GNJ said it was assuming full responsibility of the emergent biosolutions facility in Baltimore, reiterating that it will deliver 100 million doses to the government by the end of May. The health official said the Department of Health and Human Services facilitated the move, asking not to be named due to the sensitivity of the matter. The United States government is blocking AstraZeneca from using the Baltimore factory that botched 15 million coronavirus vaccine doses and has placed its rival, Johnson & Johnson, solely in charge of the facility instead. That's according to a Reuters source, a senior health official. It's the latest setback for AstraZeneca, the British pharmaceutical giant, which had been previously criticized by the government for using outdated information in the results of its vaccine trial. It's not been approved yet in the U.S. Several major countries, including Canada, France, and Germany, have also limited use of Astra's vaccine while they investigate reports of blood clotting, although the reports are incredibly rare. Millions of people have already been inoculated with it. The Baltimore factory is owned by a company called Emergent Biosolutions and previously produced coronavirus vaccines for both Astra and Johnson & Johnson. The botched doses incident occurred several weeks ago when the factory reportedly mixed ingredients for the two different vaccines together in error. The New York Times reports that the Biden administration's move to oust AstraZeneca from the facility was done to avoid future mix-ups. Last week, Dr. Anthony Fauci, the government's top infectious disease expert, told Reuters that the country has enough vaccines in the pipeline that it may not need AstraZeneca's, even if it does win approval. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.